In this video, we take a look at the inside story of a huge £100 million drugs gang network orchestrated by a dad and lad combination. Sean Page Sr. and his son, Sean Page Jr., both from Seaforth, were at the forefront of an international drug gang network. They earned millions of pounds distributing and selling Class A and B drugs, along with a number of associates connected to their gang. They were involved in million pound drug deals, however, their downfall was swift and decisive. Page Senior and Page Junior tried to flood UK streets with 1200 kilos of heroin and 500 kilos of cocaine with a street value of 100 million pounds. This particular stash was later recovered by police from a self storage unit in Lincoln and is the largest drug seizure ever made by Lincolnshire Police. The discovery led to arrests in Birmingham, Lincoln, Liverpool, Belgium and the Netherlands. During the investigation, it was found that the drugs were collected and distributed by the group to cities across the UK, orchestrated by lead figure Sean Page Senior. Page Senior, who had been on the run from UK police, ran the conspiracy from the Belgian city of Antwerp. The dad and lad combination directed their organisers on the ground, including Thomas Conway, while Intiaz Ahmed Raja invested £1 million into the conspiracy. It was from a meeting involving Thomas Conway in June of 2018 that police made their first significant breakthrough. Officers captured footage showing Thomas Conway delivering packages to a home on June 6 that year. After officers stopped two vehicles, a brown box containing two kilos of pressed cocaine was found in a car while amphetamine was discovered in the car of Thomas Conway. Further inquiries revealed that drugs were being stored at a facility in Lincoln and the following day a warrant was executed at a unit rented by Mark O'Lightly. Officers discovered more than 30,000 MDMA tablets and multiple kilos of heroin, amphetamine, cannabis brush, cannabis resin and synthetic cannabis along with a total of £25,000 in cash. A further search warrant was executed in July 2018 at another address for Thomas Conway at a caravan park in Dunstan Fen, Lincolnshire. Upon the execution of the warrants, the two gang bosses, Page Senior and Page Junior, did their best to evade authorities. The son, Sean Page Junior, was eventually arrested at Liverpool Airport while attempting to leave the country for Amsterdam on Christmas Eve 2018. While the dad, Sean Page Senior, was located and arrested by Belgian police in Antwerp in June 2019. They also confiscated thousands of euros and false identification documents. Co-conspirator Peter Nulty was the last to be arrested in October 2019 at Amsterdam Schiphol Airport, where he was awaiting the arrival of his partner from the UK. Nulty of Town Ward Street, Isle of Man, pleaded guilty in March 2021 conspiracy to supply Class A and B drugs and was sentenced to 40 months in prison. Ahead of the first trial in May 2019, all defendants were charged with conspiracy to supply Class A and B drugs. Gang associate Mark O'Lightly of HMP Lincoln was found guilty and given eight years and six months in prison. However, shortly after the start of the trial, Thomas Conway changed his plea to guilty and was sentenced to 13 years and 6 months in jail. Ahead of a second trial, which was due to begin in November 2022, Sean Page Senior, Sean Page Junior and Imtiaz Ahmed Raja all pleaded guilty to their part in the conspiracy. Sean Page Senior of Crosby Road, Liverpool pleaded guilty to conspiracy to supply both Class A and B drugs and was sentenced to 22 years and 6 months. Sean Page Jr. of Crosby Road, Liverpool pleaded guilty to conspiracy to supply Class A drugs and was sentenced to 14 years. Raja of No Fixed Address pleaded guilty to money laundering and was sentenced to 5 years and 11 months. The case concluded at Lincoln Crown Court this week and was for the sentencing of the last of the conspirators, Daniel Askew, who had previously changed his plea to guilty. Askew had hid 12 kilos of amphetamine in a bricked up area of a garage and had also been found with a further 700 grams of cocaine in a loft. He was sentenced to two years suspended for two years. 
Chief Superintendent Nicky Mayo said, quote, This is the largest drugs operation that Lincolnshire Police has ever led on, with millions of pounds of drugs seized while breaking up a network which flooded the streets of the country and beyond with Class A drugs. The sheer scale of the conspiracy has made this a particularly complex case, but we will see a force relentlessly target drug dealers and bring them to justice for their crimes.